How important do you believe the American right is the American right to bear arms and maintain militias? Is it equivalent to the right to free speech? Well, I don't think anything is equivalent to the right to free speech or the responsibility for free speech. Um, how important do I believe that that right is? Jesus, that's a tough question. You know, my dad's a hunter. He has 200 rifles, something like that. They're all single shots because he believes in aiming carefully. Um, the culture I come from, which is northwestern Canada, is a rural culture, a hunting culture. People take their guns seriously there, and it is definitely part of their lifestyle. I mean, my dad's hunted his whole life, and we ate wild meat almost all the time I was growing up. Um, I think that the right to bear arms is one of the markers of a of a free society. I don't think it's reasonable that only the police and the army should be allowed to be dangerous. Um, having said that, well, I think I'll just leave it at that. I mean, I feel obligated in some sense to go farther, especially with regards to what happened in Las Vegas, but um, it seems to me that mostly what happens after these mass shootings is that the event gets absolutely politicized and people take their standard positions and there's no moving either side and, and that's too bad. I think that it's unfortunate to use an event like the Las Vegas event or the Columbine shootings to make political capital and I think that's usually what happens and so I'm not going to do that. I think it's an important right. I believe that the individual should be allowed or even encouraged to be dangerous but controlled, you know. So along with that right is a responsibility and and I guess maybe from the NRA there should be more discussion of responsibility. Is that possible? That seems to me to be reasonable. So